Uh, I don't believe so. Well, it's it goes quarters then semis. Then, uh, I I have no clue how multiple pools work. Oh, excellent micro spacing. We got PS2 yet again. I'm so glad to see it because this is such a nice like mod. I feel like a lot of mods don't look very nice, but this one is very aesthetically pleasing. Yeah, it is. Oh, that down here was crazy. OC versus Stanley. Uh, that was some Excellent. crazy up air knee you saw. These advantage states that no, we're seeing yeah, out of like these both players. So good. So optimal with their characters. I love how Moxie covers options as soon as you get out of her string mm -hmm. so that she can cover as many options as possible. Also, with the hard call outs, like the tomahawks on the platforms, but staying clapping back with the back air. Down, down, or down air back air is a crazy combo. Makes it look like we're watching melee. Yeah. Back air of his own, or her own wolf. Excellent ledge trapping. Oh, accidentally turning that around. Oh, good nice. up smash. Moxie going to take the stock, and now we have a 0-0 zero zero game. The way that they're pressuring each other's shields is hard, to be honest. No, I agree. And they're moving like, their spaceman is so perfect and neutral. Like, everything is just, it's just really high level of play. It's really nice to watch. Those nares to cover space, mm -hmm. especially rising, are super important. And one of the things that you don't see uh, mid-level wolves do at a, at a proper, in a proper way. Typically, they just press the button and they hope it works. But Moxie, she puts it out to cover as many options as possible. And it's really cool. I think like a under an underrated aspect of like high level play is how good their disadvantage is. Yeah. Like the, the way that like people are drifting out of combos and like always using their air dodge or jump at the perfect time, it shows such like deep yeah. game knowledge. When you see reversals in top level play, it's calculated. No, it, it really yeah. is. Ledge trap there. Oh, just taking her time. Yeah, getting, getting, stealing stage control, really. Now Stain making it a last stock game. A little bit greedy right there. That's all good. Captain Falcon, Captain Falcon can win this in one string. Right? Absolutely. And we could be seeing the string right here. Catches the jump out of the combo, but doesn't quite get the stock for it. Didn't delay the IDJ enough to get the second back air, I, I believe. Ooh, good down angled forward till. Calls the neutral tech, not the timing on it though, and misses the nair knee. Okay. Wolf One good back air. To the corner. Could end this run right here. Moxie looking to end this on the edge. Wolf ledge trap is so good. Great nair running back too, spacing it perfectly. Yep. Up tilt? Yep, that move does kill. Stain having the uh, foresight to jump again there, which I believe was the third jump off ledge in, the ro in a row. No one's going to expect it three times. No, ki kind of real. Kind of real. <laughs> real. Except for Moxie. Keep it real. <laughs> it's Moxie. Moxie? Yeah. Yeah, Moxie. yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, Moxie covering the landing there. As always on the platform, it's going to be easier to do. Going to Norfair. Oh, no. Cannonbow? <laughs> Potentially. Uh, green screen in the background? Kalos, okay. Actually a great pick. Does Wolf have a wall jump? Uh, yes. Yes, but it's, it's not really that great bad. of a wall jump. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> you like wall jump and you lose more height, it feels like. You don't lose more height, yeah, but it it's, 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 it, it feels, feels like, like it. Though. It feels like it. We said that at the exact same time. Okay, going into this, let's see how this changes the matchup, but a wall jump for Captain Falcon is a wall jump earned. Yeah, he could get so much off of it, both in advantage and disadvantage. So I think we could see a lot of off stage. Any play. help he can get in disadvantage is much appreciated. True, very true. Definitely the character's biggest weakness. Yep. Triple He's fair. rising forward airs. One of the most underrated parts of Wolf's kit is rising forward air actually combos, kind of breaks the Smash conventions in that way. Excellent spacing Ooh, there. Going for the side B, that would have been a crazy hit if it connected. Slightly too high of a percent. And spot dodging that grab is kind of insane. Missing the forward tilt, but doing the up smash. Catching Stain. the landing after. I believe Stain IDJ'd there, so he didn't have a double jump. Mm. A lot less options. Those up airs are something that I don't see a lot of other wolves do that I like about Moxie's play. Uh, it's actually fairly safe on shield, and it's a really good combo starter. But Stain with a hard call out, like we know him for, the knee. 
Yeah, that's crazy. I mean, evening out the game like that is kind of is really good by Sting. Okay. Oh no, this is we're gonna see a triple fair. I think we can see quadruple fair to be honest. Yeah, uh, honestly, probably could have because Stain wasn't mixing up the DI too well. But all's well that ends well. Getting and this ledge leg, trap, another jump, ends well for Stain, thankfully. This time, we can this see some time. conditioning yeah. coming out here. Uh. But again, Stain did jump, so Moxie has that in her mental tab. Stain has jumped in a lot of times. A lot. Many. <laughs> Playing around the shield so well. I feel like there's been so many things that look yeah. like Moxie could have punished it, but I don't think that's the case. I think he's just being so tricky with his movement Excellent and his spacing. Tomahawk. Oh my gosh, the Nair one. I thought we were going to see Nair one knee, but Nair one up here. Nair one knee wouldn't kill there anyway. It wouldn't kill, but yeah. putting Wolf off stage is still... That wall jump that into side down B. tilt was great. Oh and my gosh. Up with the down the end able to of get that back with the wall was so clean on yeah. Stain's part. Great play by Stain. The call out, Living but we're on the up smash. Yeah, also a high ceiling, another great thing that Falcon can do. That is good for him. Because his up smash, like, what? Could have killed 2% later? <laughs> Many other up smashes don't scale as quick as his. Yeah. Okay, nice reversal. Mm. His combo tree is so, like, complex. Yeah, fairly safe reversal to go for there, so it's a. Up air, up air, oh. up air, up air. Oh. No reset. Moxie at 83. And giving up the stage control, unfortunately, but taking it back. Oh, but now putting Stain in the corner. Oh, Nair one knee not connecting, though. Okay, hitting the back air. So we'll see where we can take this ledge trap. I thought we were going to see a knee call out on the air to air. That would have been an insane call out. <laughs> Again, maybe? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> no. right. Now that would be raw. You missed the first one. Go for it again. Oh no. Okay. I thought the back air Miss was on the get back on air. The tech air. Or the tech roll. I'm pretty sure that would have killed. So it, it absolutely would have killed. Stain narrowly avoiding death on that high up beat. Great mix up on his part, though. These under shoots on Stain part. That back air, though, definitely could have been punished by something. Down B doesn't pull Excellent. it all game and saves it for then. Excellent, Excellent. by Stain. Using the spot dodge to try and bait a reaction and then using the down B to punish the reaction. Excellent play there. Just knowing that Wolf can't fast fall there fast enough mm -hmm. in order to punish the down B. At worst, you get a trade. And a trade there with a back air most likely would you be... You would win, it, yeah. it, it, it wouldn't kill you. Whereas the down B will kill you. Going to Battlefield now. Okay, we're 1-1 right now. I believe this is best of three. Is this event top eight, best of five? Yeah. Now we got the game three shades. <laughs> now, now we're ready. Three, now we're two, one, go! Moxie getting the first opening of this stage, or of this game. Excellent. Yeah, I feel like Battlefield was a great stage pick. I feel like Wolf can just get a lot more than Captain Falcon can on this stage. Yeah, I feel like Moxie likes incorporating platforms into her hit vantage stage. She likes <laughs> catching landings, so I think this is makes a lot of sense for Moxie. And it's uh, fairly large blast zones. Wolf has no struggle killing. Uh, so if uh, Moxie, I don't, I don't know if I fully agree. If Moxie with that. hits those backers and those down smashes, they will kill, like we just saw. Yeah, that's that's totally fair. Whereas Captain Falcon, if he doesn't hit those kill confirms, he's not really getting a kill unless he get, gets a stray hit, and his stray hits will kill a lot later than Wolf's. Ooh, down throw or down air. Great jab, <laughs> honestly. This. Doesn't get the down air on the side B, unfortunately. Stain hasn't taken too much damage, all things considered. Moxie's playing a lot more conservative now, playing <laughs> further back, under shooting more. It's really her game to to run away with. So playing back is very understandable, and uh, it's taking her really far right now. It looks like Stain's getting a little bit impatient. That Nair wasn't the best spacing. And yeah, I guess. Getting this lead back on, on Battlefield especially, I feel like Wolf can camp on this stage very well and extend his lead. Absolutely. This can be so difficult for Falcon. Just getting in is already a yeah. battle. And not only that, you have to get in multiple times in a row without letting her take this stock from you. That, that's, that's a big task to ask. We'll see if he can convert off of this. I feel like he's not getting too many openings on the ledge. Moxie makes up for recovery so well, but yeah. an unfortunate SD. Buffer system in this game is... Uh, 
I look crazy. <laughs> yeah, it's true. <laughs> and now you're gonna need a straight hit. This is why I wasn't fully on the wolf can kill super listen, easily train. Listen, listen. Because this is, this is where he struggles. Oh, listen, you have 50, like, I'm gonna need Moxie to turn her brain oh, off and start back here. Is crazy. Yeah, F tilt on the ledge, like a lot of things can take the stock here from Falcon, yep. but he just hits you nice. two times. You're in his co confirm range. And with Max Rage, it's going to be devastating Wrong. if he's able to get an opening, but the yeah, up tilt taking it. Possibly Wrong. calling a jump out of shield. Oh, but the game is Excellent. getting even up with an up air and D. Excellent kill confirm there. A little bit of a crowd pop off. We have game three, last stock, even percent. This is the Georgia difference. Oh, down air, back air. Stain putting Moxie at the ledge. Moxie, oh, holding center stage for Stain. With a down air out of disadvantage. Oh, does it call my air dodge out? But he waited for it. Oh, getting Good off combo the there. School. This is where so many openings have happened. Going for the ledge trump back air. Up tilt catching, though. Yeah. Uh, Stain, oh, Stain's been doing that down air on the platform repeatedly, so that up tilt will catch. The nair doesn't connect. Down air? Oh, but does it pull the trigger on a forward air with me? Oh, down tilt, though. Can Moxie get back here? Down tilt, will it take it? Oh, my yeah. God. Miss space the what recovery. a set! Oh, failed handshake. The skill check at the end of the set, unfortunate.